This couple came in the other day asking for a fetish wedding. Mm. It's all rubber and leather. They wanted the registrar to wear a hood. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm going to have to run the registry office. <laughs> all of life passed through the doors of that office. Eh? They told you to get lost. Do you know what? They said they'd think about it. <laughs> You know what? I was once at this. It's place. funny, isn't it? What some people find romantic. We had this one couple. He said that they wanted to get dressed up in superheroes <laughs> and do the vows. I'm so oh, sorry. Oh. So sorry. Um, I'll, I'll just get a cloth. Oh, all over me new jumper. It's expensive that wine. Right. Go and get changed. Don't be having pudding without me. Sorry. Clumsy little me. Hey, you always have a go at me if I get my phone out when we're eating. It's from Amy. Wants to meet me for coffee tomorrow. Apologies, I should put it away now. It must be wonderful to have her back in your life. <sighs> it's great. Amazing to tell the truth. I wouldn't have said that when she was growing up. A bit of a handful, was she? <laughs> Force of nature. To say the least. Think more typhoon or tsunami. But she turned into a wonderful, caring, responsible individual. That's all down to you. You gave her a family. A future, you never gave up on her. Yeah. And I'd do it again in a heartbeat. No matter what she put us through. <laughs> we made a difference to that girl's life. And that's the difference that I want to make to Jacob. Whoa, hang on a minute. Amy was homeless. She spent years in care. She means she wants me to be the best I can be. Yeah, Jacob's right. You may think that I'm pushing him hard, but... Well, I know he can take it. Oh, what's the occasion? Hi, Tracy. Sorry, I didn't think. Come in, come in. More the merrier. Hey, Mayor. No, you're all right, thanks. You lot crack on. 